Pierre, you wanna come out here? <laughs>going on guys it's your boy paris aka gold sniper 9 and i'm back with another red dead redemption 2 video for all the lovely people out there and i know it has been a week or so since you guys have heard from me now i do want to let you guys know i'm still alive do not worry i'm still going to be posting some lovely money glitches for you guys don't worry i still have you guys' pockets still in interest don't worry i'm still trying to make sure you guys do get rich in red dead online now before we do get into today's video i am going to be showing you guys three tips and tricks that you guys probably do not know and i want to let you guys know my goal in making this video and the reason why I'm making this video is because I have recently gained a lot of subscribers and some of you guys are new to the channel and some of you guys have been around for a while so let me know down in the comment section below if you guys are new or if you guys have been with me for a while I'm just curious to know down in the comment section below but I'm making this video just because I do know there are some new players in Red Dead Online and there are going to be some new people out there who are going to be looking for some tips and tricks now with that said enough of me rambling let's get into today's video so the first trick I'm gonna be showing you guys in today's video is how you guys guys can have the lantern on your hip and you guys can continuously have that so what you are going to want to do is make sure your horse is next to you once your horse is next to you what you are going to want to do is simply pull out your lantern and then from there pull out one of your pistols now it can be any pistol it does not really matter from there hop on your horse and then pull out both of your pistols or it can be one pistol it does not really matter in the gameplay you guys are seeing i'm only pulling out one pistol and when you do hop off your horse you guys will see that the lantern is stuck to your guys's hip and you guys can use this this is purely for cosmetic effect unfortunately this does not stay so when you guys do jump into a new session you guys will have to do this this will not be permanent unfortunately but i do think it's pretty cool honestly and i mean and honestly it does look great as you guys can see in this gameplay that i'm showing off here Now the next glitch I'm going to be showing you guys in today's video is how you guys can get the white variant of the bolt action rifle. Now for this, if you guys do want to have it gold like mine is, what you are going to want to do is make sure you guys do have it in gold before you guys even attempt to do this glitch. So unfortunately that is going to cost you about 35 gold bars. Now what you are going to want to do is make sure you do have the bounty hunter variant for this. Now this glitch is not going to be 100% easy. This glitch is going to be a little bit tricky if you do ask me, but what you are going to want to get in the habit of doing is pressing X down x down x now i know that does seem a lot but when you guys are doing this is not really hard and once you have gotten into the habit what you are going to want to do is head over to the gunsmith and then simply make your way over to the bolt action rifle go down to variants and then where it does say bounty hunter variant you are going to want to click that so from there what you are going to want to do is back out and then once you do have the bounty hunter variant equipped you are going to want to head back over to where it does show you the lancaster or maybe even the shotguns or whatever or whatever guns you do have from there what you are going to want to do is simply press the bolt action rifle then press down on your d-pad and then hit x to go into variants and then you are going to want to press it down once again and then going and then clicking the bounty hunter variant unfortunately this is going to be a fast paced glitch you guys will have to play around with this you guys won't get this your first try unfortunately it did take me like one or two tries to get this right but eventually once you do have the pattern down you guys will see that your gun will go invisible now the next step from there is just to rinse and repeat it again and then you guys will back out and when you guys do back out your gun should be white if you guys did make it gold before the gold will show unfortunately if you guys did not make it gold you guys will have to undo this glitch go back make the gun gold pay the 35 gold bars and then do this glitch again now one thing I do want you guys to keep in mind as you guys are watching this video, I am doing this on the PlayStation. Now, the buttons I am talking about in this video are going to be corresponding to the PlayStation. Now, if you guys are on Xbox, there will be an Xbox method linked down in the description below. So if you guys are on Xbox and you guys are looking to do this glitch and unfortunately maybe my explaining skills weren't the best, I do want you guys on the Xbox to be able to do it. It does basically work the same way. You guys do have to have the bounty hunter variant. This does work with the Lancaster and the double barrel shotgun. As you guys can see, I will have a little bit of footage up on screen. I'm not sure how much footage I will have, but I know I was able to do this with the Lancaster and the Lancaster did turn green. So I thought that was pretty cool. But with that said, let's get straight into the next tip slash trick in today's video. Now this last trick I'm going to be talking to you guys about in today's video is pretty much how you guys can get the poison poppy recipe for you guys' moonshiner. Now unfortunately if you guys are not a moonshiner, I probably already lost you guys that, you know, tip two or whatever. Bye guys. But anyway, if you guys are still here, hopefully you guys still are. You guys are the true MVP. Now 
in order for you guys to get the poison poppy dynamic timer to spawn what you are going to want to do is make sure you have recently done a bootlegger mission within the past 45 minutes now unfortunately i can't tell you where this dynamic event will spawn but i can give you a map down in the description below which will be the ultimate collector's map by gene roke shout out to that guy because you know shout out to that guy because they have pretty much made this map and this map is amazing everybody has been using it in the red dead online community it's amazing i will have a link to it down in the description below and you guys should be able to head over to that website filter out what you guys do want to find now if you guys do want to find the moonshiner event i do suggest you guys do just click dynamic events and just make sure those only pop up and do a moonshiner mission and then simply just travel around from spot to spot and you guys never know you guys might find your poison poppy you guys just might find your poison poppy that way now when i was in a mission i was able to just simply run up on this camp here as you guys can see i was able to kill these guys and i did take the poison poppy recipe out of one of the chests. now this is what the camp is going to look like unfortunately it's not going to be distinct so you guys can't really you know just tell it by its one only camp it's just going to be a random camp with like two guys next to it they're gonna be hanging out just run up in there kill them search the camp and you guys should be able to find the poison poppy recipe for your guys' moonshine with that said hopefully you guys did enjoy today's video if you guys do want to see more videos like this in the future you guys already know what to do smack that like button i don't want to make this video too long if you guys did learn something new and i did accomplish my goal by showing you guys at least one thing new that's all my goal was just to show you guys one thing new if i did accomplish that goal make sure you guys do go down below and smack that like button because it is very much appreciated and i do love all of you lovely people out there if you are new to the channel welcome why not subscribe my name is paris i upload a whole lot of red dead online content and i do want to upload a whole lot of more gaming content to this channel so if you guys are interested why not subscribe but i will see